YouTubers going on, this is your boy Krill, I'm here with another video, this is, I don't even know what damn episode we're up to, I took a leave of absence from 2k, so I don't even know, I think like episode 6 or something like that, or 7, of Sim Nation, my online league, um, for those that follows, you know, if you're new, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can keep up with further videos, um, so for this video, I'm basically going to talk about the power rankings, now I, I haven't placed, I haven't put many videos lately, because I needed to take a vacation from 2K because it pisses me the fuck off. So I had to, you know, get away from that shit. So, um, this is the power rankings because this league's been up for about a good two, two and a half weeks probably, um, maybe. So, I think the first power rankings wasn't that legit or accurate because nobody really had a full chance to prove what they're worth. Like, they you know, prove their spot, solidify their spot. So, now that they have the you know, two and a half weeks games in, it'll, it'll look more clean when I do my power rankings, and to be honest, the power rankings look as good as, uh, it, it actually suits for, um, the, for the seating right now, the playoff picture seating, so what, how, what I mean by that, I'm gonna show you the playoff picture, um, I'm gonna start with my division, so, the west side, of course, um, now, I think I put myself at sixth or fifth in the power ranking, um, Everybody in the first one to eight is honestly gonna be in my top eight in power rankings. Um, you know, prop basically only because, you know, I mean I don't want to talk about I could do the full you know league, but I just don't like to just low ball teams and stuff. I don't want to do that. So you know, some teams are just struggling. Some teams didn't find themselves yet. So I just want to talk about the playoff seating and my pair playoff ranking of the top eight on each conference. So. Um, I had myself on like 5th or 6th place, um, I'm 7th seed right now, um, we're not anywhere near done, we have like a good 3 more weeks of gameplay, about the, about 3 good weeks of gameplay until we get to the playoffs, but, um, so for this, for the power rankings in my opinion, um, all these guys from 1 to 8, including me, it, to me, are the top 8 play, top 8 teams in the West, so if I was to put it in order, because it's not in my order, my pref my preferable or order. So I would put it as the Warriors as one, followed by the Spurs, the Thunder, the Grizzlies, the Timberwolves, the Pelicans, the Lakers, then me. Um, I put myself as eight only because I'm just not playing that well. I have Paul George, I have Chris Paul, I have Ennis Cantor, and I have Scala here. Those are those four, and I have Michael Beasley. All jokes aside, I have Michael Beasley, who's a good scorer. Um, all four of those guys, you know, we don't even have to include Michael Beasley, but all the other the other four guys I have are simply scorers, and they can score whenever they want. And I, and Paul George and Chris Paul are, are great defenders, but I'm just not finding the way. I played a game earlier today with uh, I played against the Bucks. For some reason, we just couldn't get the get the game done. I mean, we actually made a run coming back, but we just couldn't finish. Uh, it's either that or I got 2K because they just make it every damn shot. So, you know, we have to figure it out. So I don't put myself above anybody that is in the playoff seat, um, seating right now. Um, the, out of all the teams that I played that I had the most trouble with so far is the Thunder. I haven't played the Warriors yet, so I don't know how they are. And I will, and I still won't know how, it, how they are because, I, like I said, I'm going to take another vacation because the game pissed me off against my game against the Bucks. So I'll be going for another two weeks, but I will keep uh, I, I will keep doing updates and stuff. I'm not gonna just you know distance myself from 2K as as stupid as the game is. So yeah, Thunder was the only team they they blew my team out like by 20 points every single time. I only played them twice. And if he's watching this video, I can definitely assure you that I will be ducking you. I will not play you for the rest of the season. Unless we're in the playoffs, and if I do see that you're trying to get in the same, to, if you're trying to purposely match up against me in the playoffs, I'm going to instantly withdraw myself from the playoffs, so you got to just play against someone else, and I hope that he is probably the hardest competition you've ever faced, so don't even try it, um, but he's a good user, I mean, he, he has Carmelo averaging like 25 damn points, he has Westbrook averaging like 23, and he's doing all this after I stole his damn player, even though he wasn't here last season. Uh, he wasn't the Thunder last season, so, you know, you know, he's managing very well. Um, the Lakers, they are, you know, they're where they are um, because they proved it to me. They're playing better basketball than me right now, even though they're only, what, uh, they're, what a game ahead of me, so, but they're still, they're doing very well, so, 
I give them that they're doing you know they're moving the ball well and he does a good job with Lonzo also with the help of Wesley Matthews plays really good defense with him and he hit some clutch shots with him so he's doing really well I know he's glad to hear that because he was butt hurt because I said he wasn't even in the, in the rankings last time so there it is if you scroll down it's not because of activity it's also because of records my power ranking is based on activity and records so that's why the Pelicans wasn't that high even though they were the uh, they are the champs still the defending champs currently right now um, only because I haven't watched that many of the games I only watched like one game of them so I really don't know what they were doing uh, what what um what they've done like how they've been playing so I'm not sure so I put them above me in the Lakers but th of course they should be higher but I just haven't seen much if anybody has an objection to that leave it in the comment section give me some stats check it out or tell me what they've been doing like tell me how dominant they are because I don't know what they were doing um, in their games I didn't get a chance to watch them so moving on to the east um, we got the whoa Oh, yeah, there we go. Moving on to the East, we got the 76ers and the Celtics. Um, I'm pretty sure the 76ers played a game today. Yeah, they did because they they were 20-6 and six earlier. So they won a game, and now they're, you know, they're first place because the Celtics was first place a second ago. So um, the 76ers is dominant as hell, um, dominant as hell, uh, for those that didn't understand what I just said because I didn't. Um, he has two, he has an 88 and an 89, who is bound to be a fucking 90-something overall. Real quick, I just want to look at it. it. This has nothing to do with the power ranking, I just, I just want to see it. But, um, yeah, 94 and ben, and Joel and, what the hell? Oh, and Joel and B and 91, yeah, so there you go. Um, but he's been playing really good basketball. I actually got a chance to play him once. I think 2K robbed me, though, in my game against him. He beat me, but I honestly thought that 2K robbed me. Um, he had Covington, I believe, and I tried to switch on him, but he, but the, but the game made me switch on someone else, you know, and then he had an easy, and I moved away, and he had an easy three-point shot. I know people probably will say, oh, you should icon switch, but when you, when it's like 15 seconds and you're down, you know, the first thing, the icon switching is not the first thing I would think of doing, so, you know, I had, uh, he, he, he pulled away and got the victory. The Celtics is playing really well, very solid. Um, he's utilizing his players very well. Um, he has a lot of weapons. He has Gordon Hayward. I, um, I was about to say Isaiah Thomas. Um, Kyrie Irving, you know, Horford, Jalen Brown. Uh, what the hell is his name? Jason Tatum. You know, he has you know he he has a really good team, and it shows on the win winners column. So my my power rankings for the East is actually what it looks like right now. Um, they actually, the East is actually very, very, very active, like, if you look at it, you got these guys, they play 12, um, the Knicks, I'm not even gonna talk about what they do, um, in terms of ranking, but they do get their games in, I'm proud of them, I expected completely less, uh, the Bulls, very active, they got 18 games, I believe, last season, they're already up to 24, so they got it done, you know, and shout out to these guys because they don't have the best teams, but yet they're giving, they you know, they're getting their games in with bad teams. Cause I already know I'm not playing that shit. All right, I'm lying because I had a losing team last season and and I played 40, so and I went like 15 or 14 and 26 or something like that. So I I can say that I would do it. So you know, shout out to them. These are good players too. Like they um they lose because they don't have their go to. They don't have that go to guy. So watch out in the free agency or in the draft because they'll most likely get a high pick. Don't sh don't count these guys out because don't t don't don't take them for lightly because the Nets actually did beat me. The Wizards is the most active user I've ever seen in my life out of all 2Ks I've ever played. Um, he he just has to get the wins. Um, this league this season we're probably not gonna get, the chances of getting in the playoffs will not be um, based off activity. It will be based off activity and your record because a lot of guys are already getting the it looks like everyone's gonna get their league minimum in which is 30 games so Miami is a solid team the Hornets caught me by surprise I thought they were gonna be around six or seven plays the Hawks I thought it was gonna be in the Hornets place at least because he had LeBron and I believe he has Jalil Okafor as well right and he has um, Malik Monk so I was actually surprised uh, and me Measury is actually a really good pickup, so I was actually expecting more, but as you can see, they don't really have much of a bench. I played them in the t um, season tip-off, so, you know, I, I, I that's why I expected more of them. And as well as the Pacers, I actually thought they would be in fifth place at least. 
um, with the addition, he has um, Home Depot and he has um, Clay Thompson. So I definitely expected a lot more. Um, he's probably still figuring out what he wants to do with his team. So it's understandable that he, he's still figuring it out, he's trying to figure out his play style, how he needs to fix it up and fix up his defensive schemes. You know, that's probably what he's working on right now, as well as me. I'm struggling as well. The Pistons, I actually expected to be around this time because he got snubbed during the um, free agency. Now, this isn't a shot towards the league at all. This is just saying, you know, you know, he lost um, his best defender, his best perimeter defender. He lost Avery Bradley, so and he lost it to his best friend, Cleveland Cavaliers, so... You know, he took a big hit. I expect him to still make the playoffs no matter what, shout out, without a shadow of a doubt. But I was actually surprised. The rest of the guys um, comes down to, like, uh, I know the Cavs user wasn't is not a, able to be around, so it's not really on him. It's not his fault. The Raptors, you know, everybody's scheduling. Everybody's trying to figure out the scheduling. So, But it's actually looking good right now in terms of activity. There's a lot of games being played, a lot of basketball. Everyone's playing except me because, like I said, I'm on vacation. I'm not fucking with this game anytime soon. I will be back on UFC as soon as I stop doing this video, but um, that's all I have for this though. This is the um, this is the power rankings. Fuck 2K. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, hit the dislike button. If you dislike 2K, hit the dislike button. I'll know exactly why you disliked it. Only like the video because you just want to support me. That's that's the only re that's the only reason you should be liking the video. Um, if you want to keep up with the league, like I said in the beginning, you know, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And that's all I got for y'all, so be good, y'all. Peace.